the Archimede Sporttaucher, or in English the Archimede Sports Diver, is a really fresh watch for weekend for sports activities, comfortably on the wrist, and it's really fresh, although there are only few colored spots on the watch, and it's a really nice one, and I'm absolutely curious what kind of commands you will leave under the video in the comment section. Hello and welcome to Watch Maxi's Watch Videos. My name is Axel and I'm glad to have you on the show. Yeah, today is the last but one video of my small six video series of the Limes and Archimede watches. And today it's about the Archimede Sporttaucher. I'm going to show it to you in the focus. Here we have it. Yep. It looks a little bit like the Orient Deep if you know it. But it's, it's way off the Orient Deep. It's several classes up the uh, Orient and I can't say that I had both. And it's a really gorgeous watch. Nicely on the wrist, fresh, and I really, really do like it. Um, I would be happy to see what you think about the watch. Leave it in the comments and uh, feel free to subscribe to my channel. Don't miss any of my future videos. And now let's move directly to the presentation of the Archimede Sporttaucher. Comparing the watch to my 40 mm Stova, the watch isn't really big and on the wrist it's perfectly comfortable. I have a 17 cm or 6 and 3 quarter of an inch wrist and the watch wears pretty comfortable and the 50 mm lug span it doesn't disturb at all. For me it's a perfect fit on my wrist, looks great. The Archimede Sporttaucher or Archimede Sports Diver is a watch which really fulfills the promise the name makes. It's a watch made for professional diver purpose and it really looks like a sporty watch should look. The case diameter is 41.5 millimeters and the thickness of the watch is just 12 millimeter. The lug width is 20 millimeter. Currently I have it on a black rubber strap and the lug to lug span is 50 millimeter. Now 50 millimeter sounds like slightly too big for me but on a wrist it makes a really good impression and isn't too big at all I think. The water resistance of 300 meter or 1000 feet is stated on the dial and the Sedita SW201 is a very solid movement and I didn't have any issue with any of my watches with that particular movement. The sapphire crystal is AR coated and a really nice and sporty watch. The 120 click bezel turns extremely precise with a safety lock like sound. Uh, let me put the microphone next to the watch and it's better to hear then. Absolutely nicely and perfectly manufactured. So what do I in particular like with that watch? Are the, the red five minute accents really nicely done and I, I love it. It gives a little bit different look to the watch and makes it look even sportier. Really, really nicely done. On the size on the wrist I just mentioned, you heard the bezel, but I would like to show you how well the bezel is done in a, in a close-up shot. It perfectly fits to the case, absolutely nicely done. And on the other side, well made, so you see the case-making expertise 
of the company with this piece of steel. Uh, let's move the bezel to see it's not a fixed bezel, so you can see it moving and you can hear it moving. Absolutely, absolutely nicely done. What I think is a really great thing, that's the way how the crown guards have been designed. You can see the crown guards grow out of the horn, protect the crown, and then slide back into the case. So nothing to see from the side. From the back, you can see it. From the back, you can see here the crown guards coming in, going out. It's even better to see from the top. So the crown guard is coming out of the case, protecting the crown, and going back into the case. Absolutely nicely done. I promised to deliver night shots, and I deliver night shots. The Archimedes Portrocher is the middle one in the top row, the third from the left. And um, even during night, you can easily read it. There is sufficient luminous power and color on the hands, on the markers, and on the Arabic numbers. Um, it's not a big dial, but it's sufficiently colored to read it throughout the night. And even if you move the watch around and take it up, um, it can be easily read. I like the blue color. I like the design of the watch even during the night. Nice thing. Oh, this watch is on a rubber or alternatively leather strap currently, which is April 2020 at a price of 940 euro with an integrated steel bracelet it is 1060 euro. There is a bronze version and there is no steel bracelet available. The bronze version on a leather or rubber strap is 1200 euro. It was a pleasure to have you on the show. I hope you enjoyed the video. You can leave a thumbs up, you can leave a comment, you can subscribe to my channel, you can share the video with co-collectors and friends and look forward to the next videos to come. So do I. Cheers, Axel.